Um, you mentioned that you used to be a semi-pro surfer. <laughs> yeah, I want to hear yeah, yeah. all about but. this. I might want some <laughs> lessons, and if you can hook me up with a spot somewhere <laughs> over in France, that would be yeah, yeah, yeah. Back in the nineties, uh, um, uh, I was grown up um, uh, uh, near near uh, a beach uh, in in southwest of France, and so so I used to to surf every day um, uh, when getting back from school. Um, and so uh, people saw that I was quite good, so uh, I, I was uh, getting endorsed uh, uh, by some brands and uh, uh, and do some uh, contests uh, uh, abroad. And um, uh, so it was quite fun, but uh, um, uh, I think it was a good option to uh, uh, to to surf the web uh, a bit <laughs> than than surf th- some waves uh, because it's it, it, both uh, are fun, but. Uh, um, uh, you know, I'm getting older, so <laughs> it's, it's quite, quite hard to, to paddle out when, when it's cold out there. So, so the word semi-pro, is, is that like you were really good at surfing, but just not making any money yet? Yeah, it, 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 it's not, not enough money. Yes. <laughs> semi-pro means not enough money. Yeah. It's almost like gray hat. <laughs> yeah. pretty close pretty close to the same thing we were really good at what we did but 